It's your girl, Nichi G. It's your girl, Nichi G. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Husky Hefe, the Husky husband himself. And today I'm here to be the voice of recognition for none other than Mitchy G. Oh my God, look at that zip. But anywho, we push forward in this household. Mitchy G, let's do it. Right now, she taking this good old, I like to call it the eye brush pen. It just helps her sculpt out. It's like it's, it's really like a little brush, a little, a little pen with some little black on it. And then she takes her pencil and she just sculpts it. Look at that sculpture. This is straight artistry. So when a woman does their makeup to the extent that women do their makeup these days and they can do it good and it looks natural, that is sheer artistry. Give them women their credit. But look at those eyes. They coming along real good. She's just brushing it up. Want to, want to give like this natural look like it's all about natural, all natural, all natural. I get his makeup. I get his makeup. And I get it's not your skin, but sometimes you got to do a little boost. You know what I'm saying? You got to boost it up a little bit. So right now she uses some concealer. I'm going to say it's an eyebrow concealer. I know, it looks a little weird. But she goes in. It's just the edge of that eyebrow a little bit. It's like outline. It's kind of like, how can I put this? It's like using color pencils and crayons when you was coloring back in school. You knew if you use both of them and you outline with the color pencil and then you color it in, like it will make it look like you just Picasso. So she getting her Picasso on by edging out these eyebrows so they can pop a little bit more. And the key to everything looking good is blend, blend, blend. Call her the neutral bullet, cause all she do is blend, blend, blend. All she do is blend, 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 no matter what. <laughs> Beauty blenders on deck, she about to blend it up. Huh? Well, yeah, she's still on her sculpting vibe, so. But now, she's gonna, oops, drop something very clumsy of her. Usually the baby out of the group of children is probably the clumsiest, but. She's going to wet up that sponge a little bit. And here you go. She's just going to start patting. The patting technique, just blend it on out. Just get it on and out. Get it on and out. And as you see, it starts to shape more. Like that regular plain eyebrow that she has. Uh, they're very weird. But you see it start to come to life. Um, and it's great. She's doing it dunk, isn't it? She's feeling the vibe. Oh. A little touch up sometimes you should just leave well enough alone but sometimes people are perfectionists and really wanted to i don't really see too much of a difference so now she's about to go over the eyelid with some more concealer and make sure your concealer matches your skin tone like you don't want it too far off too light you don't want it too dark you know if it's too light you almost look like ghost face killer no pun intended <laughs> But you look all ghosty and stuff, man. More like you're coughing pretty. <laughs> but, um, this show must go on. Now she has a palette, so I guess she's about to pick her colors. If I'm not mistaken, I think she's gonna go with something that's, that's a lighter pink dinner shirt. But I think she's kind of trying to match that shirt she has on, which is this cool. I wouldn't say it's mauve. Would it be mauve? I don't like this teal, white teal, greenish blue, pinkish mauve shirt she has on. Now she's taking the brush and she's really blending. I don't know if she's doing a cut crease. I don't. Achoo! Sneezing. Oh, we got another. Oh, oh. Uh oh. Achoo! Mm mm mm. That's crazy. It must be something in the air. And I don't think it's love. No, I'm just play. It's always love in the air in this house. Oh. Anywho. But now, she started with that pink. Now she's going with a darker color, as I see. 
that is, if I'm not mistaken, that is the transition color. I know a thing or two. Now, I want to see if she's going to do a halo, a cut crease, a smoky eye. Right now, that is very smoky-esque. So, we shall see what happens. So, this color that she's adding. Hmm. It's very far-fetched, being for what she's wearing. What could she be doing with that? world may never know. Now she's going to the handy dandy palette. Oh, palette to palette to. Okay. So that's what she did. She pretty much used that third color. It's looking like whatever color she picked, she just wanted to use it to kind of blend in with the, uh, the pink and the mauve color on her eyes. She was using that third color to use as like a lightning layer. Kind of like you didn't want to use white because white could come off as, as too pigmented of a color with that tear blue. So I think that was pretty smart of And uh, what would we call this? This is, this to me, this is still a smoky, a smoky cut crease eye. That's what I consider it. Yeah. I'm going to say that. Yeah, it's smoky cut crease. So now she's going to take that eyeliner. Once again, it's the method of what I talked about with those color pencils, man. If you was coloring in school, you know you got to do this. You got to make it pop. You got to get it popping. You got to get it on and popping. Ooh, ah, ah. I got to practice on my vocals. Yeah, I think she heard me sing. Outline it. Do your thug dizzle. Uh, do your thug dizzle. Uh. And she's very calm and meticulous. I gotta give her your credit. Ladies, when you're doing your makeup, make sure you're taking your time. You're being, this is where you want to be a perfectionist because you don't wanna, you know, fidget too much and move and then it's all over. Right now, she's just taking a, a brush with some, some black on it to just go around those eyelids to make this like a full black eye. It's once again, it's just gonna make those colors that you see up top pop more. Look at that, boom. And just clean up. I always keep you a, a white and just clean up. Cause things do spill, things do happen. You know, it be like that sometimes, okay? Now, this is a first. Um, I usually don't see her putting on her lashes first. So I guess she was trying to give y'all the full experience of getting the eye out the way and moving along. Move along, move along like you said you would. Oh, you wanna take this wrong, move along. I think that was All American Rejects. That was back in my VH1 days in high school. Wake up early, you know, bump that uh, jump start. I don't know if they still do it. But yeah. And I can see that this um this whole eyelash thing gets a little tricky. That glue, that precision. Like I said, ladies, take your time. And don't go out using no hair glue for your um eyelashes. That's how you mess around and get infections in the eye. And then next thing you know, you're sitting up there like, you know, I can't get these things off. And then you wake up in the morning and it's an eyelash on your head. She ain't got no mink eyelashes, but I don't know why girls need eyelashes, but whatever. The mink eyelashes be looking like windshield one. So once again, now she's adding her uh, her foundation, but you see she's taking this sponge and she's going around to make sure she carve out that black part under her eye. And now you're just about to get more application of foundation. Um, that right there is... I don't know which one is the foundation at this point. Maybe the top part was the... Uh, was the... Uh, color correcting or something. Oh, I 
I think she's fusing like multiple foundations. And sometimes I heard you got to do that because a lot of our darker skinned girls don't get as good of uh, foundation choices as, you know, their counterparts. Uh, you know, whether it be lighter skinned women or um, white Anglo Saxon Protestant women. So, that being said, you got to make it do what it do. The show must go on. That's all I'm saying. So, right now, of course, it's just blend, 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 baby, blend. Blend, 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 baby, blend. Hey, I said blend, blend, hold on. Blend, baby, blend. Hey, blend, 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 baby, blend. Oh, oh, blend, huh? Blend, hey, blend, baby, blend. Hey, yeah. So she's just using a brush and she's going around. She's blending, smoothing it out. And you see it's coming along. It's looking so natural. And that's always a plus. And shout out to her hair right now. It's looking wavy, baby, with the ponytail. I don't know if that's Yaki Pony. But anyway, anywho. <laughs> she's doing a thug thizzle. Boy, she putting them marks on like when we played football. I had to put the black around her eyes. But she just blend, blend, hey, blend, baby, blend, hey, blend, 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 baby, blend, hey, hey, blend, 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 baby, blend. So, this right here is. I want to say like your translucent powder. Yeah, I think that's what this is. I hope that's what this is. I think I'm saying it right. But yeah, so you just put this uh powder around to kind of let it, you know, um, sit around your face and kind of like, what you call, just brighten you up. So right now she hitting that T zone, that T zone. So she about to hit that T zone because I think she's getting ready to um, highlight things. Gotta hit that T zone, man. Gotta hit the T zone, man. Rudy's got the chalk, the chalk, the chalk, chalk zone. Rudy's got the chalk, but Michi got the makeup. Ooh, hey, that's a million dollar hit right there. But man, it's coming along. Like I said, women, you want to blend, you want to blend, you want to blend, baby, blend. Like, that's the biggest thing. Take your time. Blend. I don't know why she's doing all this extra stuff. Just keep going. And geez, Louise. Of course, you know, you got to get those lips right. That is a lip liner. Brought to you by none other than Husky Hefe himself. Yes, I made this product myself. Y'all can find this product at huskyhefe.com. I am kidding. But if you do want to visit their website, go check your boy out. So now, I told you she was getting ready to contour. So when you contour, you're pretty much just making that, that cheek and stuff look more defined and areas look more defined. Chiseled, as we should say. You should be looking chiseled. Cut like a diamond. Diamonds are forever. Forever, ever, forever, ever. But yeah, she just doesn't go in and contour. And she's showing you different colors she used. I'm really waiting for the highlight and the shimmer part. Like, let's get a puzzle. But it's almost done. That's what's crazy. This literally took, man, all of what, about 15 minutes? Like, it's kind of fantastic. Bronza, it's time for some bronza. There it is. Gotta lighten it up. Gotta look like a million bucks. So I'm taking that that light translucent powder plus that bronzer just made it look a little bit lighter under the eyes. And now she's applying, I guess, some brush, some more pink, so you can feel the, the pink vibe that's in this in this um, garment that she's wearing. And hit it with a little shimmer. Shimmy. Boom. Boom. She has is just blinged up. Every time I come around your city, bling, bling. Yeah. Wow. Let's use some, some of that mascara. The mascara to flip those eyebrows up. You're looking good. You're looking like a million bucks. If you ain't a million, you're 999,999. You're just a dollar short, but you're looking good, girl. You're looking good. Yeah, so that was the setting spray. That was a bad spray at the end. Um, yeah. 
but it's all said and done looking very Indian-esque Pocahontas with this ponytail did Pocahontas have a ponytail? I don't know but yeah man that was it man that was your boy Husky Hefe the Husky husband himself and I did come to you live today to show you that makeup can be done and I know what I'm talking about if you would like to set up an appointment with me just hit my email hit my you know what you can contact me through my what like just hit me up because I can get you in there this is makeup with Michi G this is Michi G's beauty bodega and I was happy to be here make sure you like and subscribe to this video tell me if you want me on more stuff anywho we gonna get out of here we'll holla we love you peace